So, I think Roseanne's is called Rose, uh, Rosie's Joint. Okay, she got one too. You know, and I know Snoop got him a spot. Wiz Khalifa sell his own shit, and he, I guess he opening up a spot or got one or whatever. But it's a lot of people that got their own little spots where you can just go and just, nigga, uh, hey, how high the moon. Uh, I'm finna jump off this Milky Way right here, nigga. I'm gonna land over here on Jupiter. Nigga, don't let me down yet because I got this shoe started. I'm trying to ride on about 4 o'clock in the morning. Nigga, I'm on this uh, 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 carpet ride. Yeah. That's how it is here. This is just regular shit for us. This is regular shit. I be having Carl rolling because Carl like, wait a minute, what? He was like, okay, well, what about your job? I said, well, look, hey, look, hey, 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 hey. You could buy urine here, partner. Two for ten dollars. Some places, but if you get the one for two for ten, guess what it's going to do? It's only going to cover certain panels, okay? But if you get the one, the $20 box, okay, black and gold, then therefore it's going to cover more panels. I, I had him dying. He was like, wait a minute, what? Y'all sell what down there in California? I said, if you don't knock it off, stop it. We own our own shit over here. We trying to get our own exit and everything. We trying to do our own thing. We trying to just say, fuck it. We a part of it. Like, nigga, we Canada, nigga. Yeah, that's what we own. We trying to get our own shit like Canada, nigga. Anyway, but uh, <clears throat> bottom line is uh, I feel good this morning. I needed it so motherfucking bad. Now I can go back and tell y'all about why I need it. Because I know I was on this little tangent while I go about this other bullshit. But it is what it is. Fuck it. I ain't watched the news in a minute, so that's what's in the background, and I'm seeing some motherfucking inmates been captured. I didn't even know none been gone. I've been over at my man's house for the past few days. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, since Black Friday, I've been with this motherfucker. Okay? Reason being, my car had a leak. Ain't that a bitch? I started leaking. Um, uh, uh, I was going to uh, call it antifreeze, which it is. Coolant. I was, I was leaking. I had had a coolant leak in my car, okay? I been going fucking through. I mean, just, oh, my God. Oh, my fucking God. You know? And I guess the reason why I been, well, let me say. Should I be saying this or not? Okay, because I been having a lot going on. I've been having a lot motherfucking going on. I love my baby to death. Okay, let me talk about him for a minute because it's going it's gonna to all tie in together about the car, so just hold on. Um, We are so cool. I love him. He loves me too. But baby got some low-key Kanye in his ass. He got some Kanye in him tough. I'm like, you know what? Look, check this out. Stop checking for what the fuck I'm going to put on. Get your shit together. Okay, you choose the... Is that what you're going to wear? Okay, then you wear that. But don't, don't, you ain't got the, what? That is our problem. You understand what I'm saying? I don't need you fixing me up. I don't need, okay, well, baby, why is this I last it? I don't need, I don't need that. <laughs> and girls, when I tell you this is what I got, okay, this is crazy, man. This is crazy. Like that day I, I told you I did a video, I was on my way going to his house. And I was riding in the car and everything. I had this maxi dress on that day. Okay. I had this maxi dress on. And it was like a strapless. But it had it had like a crisscross in the back. It was like, I don't know, it was like 90 degrees that day. It had crisscross in the back. I've never worn it on here. I don't even think I've ever posted any pictures on anything about this cute little maxi dress. I got it from, I think it was a... Uh, uh, what is that, uh, um, um, uh, what is, what is the name of that little place in, um, Off the Rack or some shit like that in Ontario Mills Mall. And it was, a uh, badass little motherfucking little maxi dress, right? And so, I had bought it a long time ago. I'd never really been able to really wear it because it wasn't something that I could really wear even though it stretched. And a lot of times, you know, that stretch shit to have you thinking, nigga, I could really do a large. Nigga, you could do a 3X, motherfucker. You could really do a 3X. Looking at them motherfucking threads. Oh, no. Shit is whining, dog. You might want to do a 3 on that. You know what I'm saying? Because motherfuckers get it fucked up. Be like, well, since it's stretched, nigga, I could really do a large. 
Anyway, I've been one of them. So that's why I'm talking, you know what I'm saying? I'm talking about me right now. Okay, I'm talking about me. Okay. So, anyway. Uh, so it was, It's. I think it's like a medium. And But I, you know, I've had it for the last couple of years. I bought it, I don't know, for a jazz festival or something. And it's just always been in my closet. And, you know, man, my closet is crazy. I've been thinning them out, though. You know what I mean? And, and I've been donating a lot of stuff, you know, because I've been feeling so guilty about all of the bags in which I've been getting regularly. I've been getting some badass bags. Got some and shit right here. Um, and so now I'm just giving them to my daughter for um, Christmas. I got this one. Um, this one was 19-something. You know what I mean? So she got this one. And so I'm just giving them to her. I'll just put them all in something. And she's going to get them for Christmas. And then this one. This is a little coach one. That was a Dooney and Burke one. And then this one. And I think this one was, uh, I don't know what it was, but still somewhere around that. So I've been getting these bags. Yo. I've been getting bags, badass shoes and shit too. So I, I, I ain't done no haul, no nothing. Because I've been having other shit going on. I'm dealing with a Kanye, you know. So my mind, you know what I mean, sometimes I... You know, and I mean, he's a lovable man. He's so lovable. Oh my God, y'all! He's y'all see, he took me bowling the other night. Took me bowling. I had I had posted that shit on Instagram and all that shit. That I had to post a picture, or whatever. So we had went bowling the other night. But he's, I mean, he's a very, very lovable, sweet, sweet man. Oh my God, he's a sweet, sweet man. He's there's nothing that, you know, I don't think he would not do for me, really. You know, but you know, like my auntie was saying, you better watch that motherfucker. Lord, we was going to the Grand Canyon, right? We were supposed to go to Grand Canyon on Friday, for on Black Friday. My auntie. We couldn't go to the Grand Canyon because we was going to take the car. We wasn't going to take his truck. We was going to take the car. So, I had to leak. So, we ended up putting the car in the shop. And I just got the car out yesterday. So, yeah. It cost me over $600 too. Six hundred motherfucking dollars for a coolant leak. The car never overheated. It never got hot. All it said was, um, um, check coolant level. Check the coolant level. The coolant level was low, you know, and I was having this issue for like the past two weeks or whatever. And I mean, I, I was going through a lot with this coolant thing, but in all the while it wasn't, you know, it wasn't leaking so profoundly. So I was like, okay. You know, maybe it might be okay. And babe was like, well, just watch it and we'll just see where, what happens. So I, when I took it to Pet Boys, I was like, okay, well, I'm going to just go around the corner to Pet Boys and see what they say, you know. Um, and because I think the, the check, the the check, it was like $30 or something. So I was like, okay, that's how I found out that there was a leak. They had put some dye in there and it was like, okay, well, when we put this dye in there, come back in a couple of days and it's going to say where the leak is. And so, um, Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving, is when I went back and they checked it and they said, you got a leak and we can't fix it. You got to take it to the dealer. So that's how we ended up not going to the Grand Canyon. But my auntie was like, look, don't you know those motherfucking women that came up missing around the motherfucking parts? You better sit your black ass down. Okay, this motherfucker, he love your ass. You better sit your motherfucking ass down, okay? Shit, this motherfucker's done walked off ledges and all kind of shit down there, motherfucking. Um, this how my auntie talk to. So the way I talk, this is some regular shit for my everybody in my squad. This is how we talk to one another. You better watch your motherfucking step, nigga. You better watch your step, niece. While you taking your ass down there to the motherfucking grand cave, you better watch that nigga's hands. Watch his feet. Nigga might trip you. Man, me and my auntie was rolling one night. Rolling. She was like, niece, oh no. I know y'all motherfuckers all in on some lost and love shit, but uh, check this out. This motherfucker right here, oh no, niece. You know what I'm saying? Have some fun. It's like that motherfucker keep your pussy and all that old type of shit. You know what I mean? But uh, uh, watch this motherfucker. This my auntie. Real shit. Because y'all. Girls, let me tell you, look, baby be checking for me real tough. I mean, he do some shit that I ain't never, you know what I mean? Well, wait a minute, because remember that one motherfucker I was with, y'all, remember a couple, what, about a year or so ago, 
That motherfucker had them goddamn candles burning in the motherfucking house. Them, them motherfucking ones that they be doing at the wake. The one, the candles with, with the glass and shit, with the Virgin Mary and shit on the motherfucker. That motherfucker had them motherfuckers in the house talking about he was trying to get it romantic for me. I, nigga, if you don't get them goddamn candles up out of here, that nigga signified that one got shot up down the street. If you don't take that shit up out of his motherfucking living room, nigga, he had one all sitting all on the TV and all this over here and then one over here and this other motherfucking one smell like Centronella. Nigga, if you don't get the shit up out of this motherfucking uh, kitchen and shit right here right now, yeah, he was like, baby, I set the mood. I, look, I was motherfucking burnt up some steaks and shit, but it was all right. That motherfucker cooked, all, cooked up all this shit. Oh, this, baby, this is this, this dirty right. Yeah, him. He was well, he was a spot-checking motherfucker. You remember that motherfucker? Him. Well, I got to be another one, but this motherfucker right here, nigga, look. Hey, this is a millennium motherfucker right here. This nigga's up to date to it. He done took the seminar. This motherfucker was big, va va valet motherfucking Victorian in the class. And you understand me? He conducts the seminars now twice a month. This motherfucker is so sick with it. Oh my God, my shit is ringing like a motherfucker. Now this is my auntie. This my motherfucking auntie, y'all. Hold on. Damn, I can't really answer it. Because see, once I start talking, then she just going da 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 Look, I'm show y'all her picture. My auntie. My auntie like shit. Hey, this motherfucker, he don't know needs this motherfucker love you, but just mm -hmm. you better watch this motherfucker. Watch this motherfucker. I said, Auntie, look, 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 Auntie, I ain't scared though. You know what I mean? My auntie said, You know what you niece? You's a crazy motherfucker. I said, nah, Auntie, look, I'm just a thundercat. Yeah, I'm just a thundercat, you know what I mean? I'm one of them, you know, I, I, don't, I don't run and, and hide and, and be all scared and shit. I, I'm, I'm not one of them. I ain't never been, um, I ain't never had no dude put his hands on me or, um, or do any of those types of things. So I don't have that kind of fear, you know, I don't have that kind of fear that, you know, damn, my shit is, niggas, my shit bringing like a motherfucking slot machine right now. Nigga, my shit is doing all kind of shit over here in this motherfucker. I mean, baby is texting and my auntie is calling Tony Texas. Shit, I got shit going on around this motherfucker. This bitch is cutting up. God damn, motherfuckers is trying to get a hold of my ass this morning. Can I just get some shit out? And I'm going to call each and every one of y'all motherfuckers back in a few minutes. I promise to God I am. Okay. <clears throat> I know y'all probably saying she's sitting like she uncomfortable. Nah, I'm good. I'm just trying to get it all in. Okay. Girls, this motherfucker right here, man. I mean, we cool. We cool as a motherfucker. We be on the same page. We do the same kind of shit. You know what I mean? We be on the same shit. What I'm on, he be on. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? We got to have a glass of wine every now and again. You know what I mean? And But, I mean, he just, he's, he's just, he's just so lovable. And what... What, like, I, my auntie was like, okay, well, niece, what is it? What, 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 this motherfucker done put something on your ass. What has he done done to you? I was like, man, auntie, it's, just, it's, a, it's a few things and shit. Okay, Candy Boris is coming up. And, um, it's just, uh, um, it's just something different. It's a different chapter. You know, every cha every chapter in your life requires a different you, okay? And I think the things that I have gone through made me the woman that I am today, and it just kind of it strengthened my resolve. And as I go through all these turns, rounds, and, and dips and turns and he peaks and valleys and, uh, and, and, and over bridges and turnarounds, you know, it's like I get these little pebbles in my path of progress, but I still keep going. Well, and, it, and as I get through all these different, I come into these different villages and these different places, and I'm like, man, where I'm at right now, it's like it's so fucking cool. You know, I mean, I am truly with a man that I am totally 